Hello, Jester Good here. Today we're taking a look at the Lego Movie 2 Benny Space Quad set with 68 pieces, four minifigures, and retails for $10 in the United States. Our first minifigure is Benny, and this is the cheapest way ever to get Benny, I guess, besides the collectible minifigure series coming out. And his face print is very similar to the one from 2014, but he does have a new back facial printing where he looks a bit worried. But other than that, uh, we do have the same helmet from 2014 from my understanding with the chipped chin strap and also the same torso print it looks like with the faded away classic space logo. And he has a walkie talkie as an accessory. A pink Lego spaceman. Now this is incredible. This is Lenny and they reprinted the classic Lego space helmet or one of the two classic Lego space helmets. I can't believe they did it because apparently that had sustainability problems with the chin up top, which would get chipped or whatnot, which is why Benny has a crack in his chin. But they must be doing something differently here to make it a lot more stable and sturdy. Other than that, no back printing or anything like that, which is perfectly fine because classic space men do not have back printing. The pink air tanks is incredible. Uh, my minifigures face is a little bit inky uh, it's just a little misprint but Lenny also has a wrench so here is Kenny and this one kind of means a lot to me because I have the classic yellow spaceman I got this in a space probe set I reviewed back in 2015 mine is the version 2 though because it doesn't have the indentation on the side for the strap or whatever you want to put on there the visor and mine actually has the strap that's a little bit more elongated so this is a reprint of the version one helmet, which was a lot rarer and would chip, which I kind of touched on with the last figure. The design of this is just so crazy to actually have in a 2019 Lego set. No back facial printing or torso printing, so I don't even have to remove the helmet. You got the air tanks, and that's it for Kenny. Well, actually, he also has a metal detector. And finally, we have Jenny, which is a white classic spaceman, and the design of this has a little blaster accessory. But again, just crazy to get a reprint of that old helmet piece with, I guess, a new version that's a little bit more sustainable at the chin strap and no back torso printing or anything like that. So we have three separate builds. The first is a very simple build with a printed brick up front and some details all around. And there's enough room to fit one minifigure inside the seat and even the steering wheel to boot. Next is a simple Moon Rover build, which is a very similar build to the one in that space probe where I originally got my yellow spaceman from. There's clips at the back to hold some of the utilities in this set. Not too much going on. We do have these smaller wheels, a steering wheel, and enough room to fit one minifigure as always. Finally, we have this little robot right here, which reminds me a lot of that robot from the space probe set I was talking about earlier. So we have two builds similar to that, but then again, a lot of the builds in classic space, especially with the smaller sets, were similar to one another. He has an arm on both sides, as well as an antenna head up top. The box for this is the $13 box size from 2013, but this is a $10 set, and we have some details at the back. And the instructions have no advertisements to them, which is quite a shame. I have no complaints with this set. It's amazing that they've reprinted old pieces that were out of production. It's amazing that there's a new pink spaceman. And the builds of the set are perfect tributes to some classic builds that even I'm familiar with. So with all that considered, and just the value of this set, for $10 you get some phenomenal minifigures and some very interesting nostalgic builds. This is an A-plus set. I recommend it to any LEGO fan. So that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.